How's it going guys? Welcome to this tutorial video for how to play this improvised piece by Mistful Plays that he posted on TikTok a while ago. If you haven't already checked out Mistful Plays on TikTok, I definitely recommend it. He's an absolutely incredible musician. But anyway, let's get into it. All right guys, so this piece is played very freely. There's not really any rhythmic pulse throughout the whole thing. So what I'll do is I'll go through one phrase at a time and just play it really slowly and break down all the notes that I'm playing. One little tip when learning something that's being played quite freely is to not try and play it at full speed. Because even though you can hear what you want to play, it's better to practice it really slowly. So for example, we have this run. Okay, so it's played very fast, but when I learned that, I didn't play it anywhere near that quick. It took me a while. So I was, I was learning it at this kind of speed. Do you see what I mean? So it's all about making sure you know where the, where the fingers know where to go. So you don't even have to think about it. And that's how you get it up to a speed where it's comfortable and you can play it as expressively as you want. All right, so let's get started with the first phrase. It looks like this. Okay, so starting left hand on this C and then playing these notes into this minor seven chord. Then the right hand is playing these notes. And then coming back down to those. Okay, so again. There's the notes. these three chords we're sort of rolling those up and then we finish in the left hand by going like that okay so the whole thing a little bit slower now for the next phrase we're starting on this F minus seven again, these three notes. And then we have this fast run. Okay, so notes there, let's play it really slowly. Um, so up to that G, that what I'm doing there is going one, two, three, four, one, two, three, one, three, four. And it's important to hit that with the four because what we're going to do is roll down like this. And it's a lot easier if you go hit that with the three. Okay, so one more time. Down to the E flat. Then from there we go. Okay, so starting with the C on the thumb, going to the four on the B flat. So full thing. Okay, and a bit faster. And that's our first two phrases. I just want to jump in quickly to say if you've got any feedback or suggestions for songs that you want me to make a tutorial for, please leave it in the comment section. And if you're finding this video helpful, please consider giving me a like or even subscribing to my channel. It really does go a long way. Next phrase looks like this. All right, so starting here, going up to this D by going up these notes using all five fingers actually, like that. And it's quite fast, like that. And when we hit that D, we also hit this chord on the left hand, C minus seven as before. So. Like before, we do that little roll down. So three, two, thumb, three. And then hitting that G. From the G, we go to this chord. Okay, and then from there we go like that with the left hand. So that takes us to the next phrase, which looks like this. All 
Okay, so we're starting with it's G minor nine. And the right hand is going between these three chords. Okay, left hand stays the same. Then we move to this one. And the right hand is going. Okay. So together. Finishing on this F minor 11. And then the E flat, he does hit it again very lightly. Okay, next phrase. Quite simple. We're going rolling up to that D and hitting that same chord and then going down these notes. Like that. So those last two phrases connected look like this. And then we finish in the right hand Left hand stays where it is, the right hand goes like this. Okay, so I'll take the pedal off so you can see those notes a bit better. So octaves, finishing with those three notes. And those octaves are sort of rolled up. left hand it just stays on that chord the whole way. So that's all the phrases, now I'll put the whole thing together and play it a little bit slower than normal. So thanks very much for watching and to finish off I'll give you a full performance on a real piano. Here you go.